Here we go again. Sony have announced the PlayStation Plus Essential offerings for the month of September 2023. Three games will be downloadable starting Tuesday, September 5th. It's an interesting month. Please do me a favor and throw me a like to keep this series going. And here we go. Game number one is the Saints Row reboot. The rumors were indeed true, an open world action title in which we start our own gang of outlaws and plan to take over all the other criminal organizations in Santo Ileso. One year ago at launch, Saints Row was packed with bugs and glitches and that was reflected in the Metacritic score, which is 61%. Yikes. Since then though, a great deal of work has gone into fixing issues and making this open world a playground of mayhem. Whether that's wingsuiting around, playing oversized Jenga, are using ridiculous weapons like the Thrustbuster. Honestly, I could play with this thing all day. Whee! Every five minutes you'll be in a firefight and the melee combat goes hand in hand with that, with some really inventive special moves on offer, like stuffing a grenade down someone's shorts and flinging enemies back where they came from. Over 1,000 enhancements have been made over the last 12 months, including two new city districts, tons of new missions, two story expansions, and so many cosmetics it's impossible to see them all. Saints Row's story is the weakest element for sure, as the dialogue and acting is honestly like a primary school nativity play. But without a doubt, playing in co-op with a friend papers over the cracks. Plus, there are some 12-person multiplayer shenanigans too. Don't expect too much from Saints Row, and you'll easily have enough content to tide you over until Spider-Man 2 releases in October. Oh, and you should really check out the character creator in this game. The community have done a pretty good job with some of these. Oh. Next, we have Black Desert Traveler Edition. The open world MMORPG has been here for years, constantly updating and growing over time. And right now, many players who left are returning to play again. With a solid core story complemented by numerous side quests in a world that is begging to be explored. The experience begins with its best part, an in-depth character creator, and then we are simply left to our own devices. Back in 2019, we had little to no explanation of the mechanics and systems of the world, and we had to use Google. I do hope times have changed now. Black Desert is packed with combat, but it isn't all about that. You'll be trading, fishing, horse training, cooking, and trying your hand at alchemy too. Oh, and Black Desert has the same Metacritic score as Saints Row, 61%. And finally, Generation Zero, a first-person shooter set in an alternative Sweden in 1989. Here, violent robots have taken over, and now it's your time to fight back and take down everything from scouting drones to robots bigger than a house. Gen Zero is not an arcade-style shooter. Oh no, this is all about survival. And the highlight is cooperative play online. With up to three friends, you can distract and attack all the machinery in Sweden. Coordination is the key. Generation Zero has a review score of 45 out of 100, but many updates have been added since then, including homestead building and new weaponry. So will you try it? So what are you playing this month? Please sound off in the comments below if you're happy, sad, delighted or mad. I'm Adamaru, you're awesome. I'll see you next time.